start off with coverage of our very successful Varsity Hawks soccer team that's been tearing through the postseason and hunt for the state championship. When we left off last month, the boys, led by head coach Trent Kutch, had just collected wins against Lancaster and Forney and were preparing for the second half of their season and another chance at many of their district rivals. The Hawks traveled to Ennis and took down the Lions in a close game, 1-0. Red Oak then hosted one of the district's toughest teams, the Waxatchee Indians. Despite playing a hard-fought game, the Hawks dropped the contest 1-0. But Red Oak bounced back with wins against Terrell, 3-0, and Kaufman, 2-0. The Hawks also came up big in a game against Maybank, winning 6-0. On March 14th, the Hawks hosted Ferris for senior night. Hawk seniors were honored during a pregame ceremony, and Red Oak took the game by the score of 6 to 0. However, the Hawks would face a tougher challenge against the district-leading Corsicana Tigers in their next and final regular season game. The Hawks remained locked in a 1-1 tie with Corsicana at the end of regular play, but disappointingly lost the game in a shootout. Despite the loss, the Hawks had secured a spot in the playoffs and had finished out their season with a 13-5 district record. Their first postseason game, the Bi-District Playoff Contest, came against the Seagaville Dragons at Billy Goodloe Stadium on March 20th. The Dragons got on the board first before halftime, but goals by Hawks Clayton Stanford and Franco Valdez soon followed, and Riddle hung on for the 2-1 victory, advancing them to the second round of playoffs on March 25th. The Hawks then faced the Midlothian Panthers at Duncanville High School and only needed one point to win the game and keep their playoff hopes alive in a 1-0 win. The Hawks' next game took place on March 28th in Cedar Hill against Crowley and drew many Hawks fans. Red Oak jumped out to a 2-0 lead and held on for yet another victory. We'll cover the Hawks' next game against Mesquite Poteet in the regional semifinal playoff game in the April edition of our show when we hope to bring you more good news about our Varsity Hawks soccer team.